Hello everyone. So in this video, we're gonna see the resistor curves calculation. I'm going to teach you the SMD resistors curves. Okay. So as you can see here, as a definition, generally the SMD resistor can have three or four digits. The last digit represents the number of zeros. So as you can see here, always the last digit represent the number of zeros or multiplier okay so the letter r shows the position of decimal point when it is placed before or between digits so basically you will find over the smd resistors as you can see three number or four number okay so Sometimes you will find just that this digit here are just numbers. And sometimes you will find the letter R or K or M with numbers. Okay. Always the last digit when you have an SMD resistor with three digits. Always the third digit is the multiplier or the number of zeros so let's take an example here as you can see we have here 101 if you find for example over the resistor 101 means as you can see this one is the multiplier we're gonna put zero here so this means 100 ohms so 102 the two means two zeros as you can see 123 as you can see we will put the first two digits and the three zeros here as you can see okay so 123 equals as you can see 12,000 ohms equals to 12 kilo ohms okay and when you have for example the four digits an smd resistor with four digits as you can see here so always the fourth digit is the multiplier the same working principle as this resistor with three digits okay so we have here examples for example if you have a resistor with this code 1421 means 1420 ohms so one means one zero here we have two means two zeros four means four zeros okay so 1204 equal as you can see here to 1.2 mega ohms okay now let's see the other example so sometimes you can find a resistor with this codes as you can see as we have seen here in the definition so the letter r shows the position of decimal points this is the decimal points as you can see when it is placed before or between digits so let's see those example here okay so if we find for example r10 here you find r10 means point one as you can see r is point and we have one so 0 0.1 ohms so let's assume that you have a resistor with 5 r4 means 5 points as you can see here 4 ohms so if you have for example 7 r50 equal to 7.5 ohms so 50 r0 means 50 ohms okay so this is the working principle of the resistor curves calculation. So sometimes I want to add that sometimes instead of R, you can find K or M. Do same working principle. If you find, for example, K10 means 0 0.1 kilo ohms. But if you find M10 means 0 0.1 mega ohms okay here if you find 5 k4 means 5.4 kilo ohms but if you find 5 m4 means 5.4 mega ohms this is the working principle on how you can calculate 
जो एस एम टी रजिस्टर्स